How cool was that? That was an awesome intro. Welcome to another floppy deep dive where we take a deep dive into classic video games on the Amiga. And today I'm starting a new series called Virgin Amiga Chronicles where I'll be playing games on the Amiga for the first time. So pull up a chair, grab a joystick, and let's get started. Hey guys, today we're going to take a trip back in time to the early 90s and play one of the most memorable games of that era, Moonstone, A Hard Day's Night. I've never played this game before, so let's see what it's all about. I can go up to four players. Obviously, it's just me. I'm doing one. Gore on, of course. We want gore. Practice, nah. We're just going to go in here, select a knight. I did read the manual a little bit, so I knew what I was kind of doing. Um, I didn't want to go completely blind into this. But uh, let's see how well I do. Select a knight. We've got a blue one, an orange one, a green one, and a red one. I'm going to go. I don't know if one's better than the other. I'm going with green. And I want to call him Sir Tom. So we got this big map here. And looks like different places to move. I'm just going to try to go to this first area here. See what's in here. I know that I fight. And that's about all I know at the moment. Let's see what we got here. That's some kind of bird. Oh, Lord. Kill that thing. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Oh, kill it. Kill it. Oh, damn. How many are there? Ah, oh, dang it. Well, so I just lost a life. Sir Tom. My strength's only one. Everything's just one. I have zero XP, 10 gold pieces. Looks like 20 hit points. I have padded armor and a long sword. Can't believe I died. All right, so now it's the other knight's turn. The computer's playing all these. One from each corner of the map. This one's coming my direction. Next day. Okay. I can go back in here and fight again. Let's go to a different one. I guess these are just little different shrines or some sort. I love the, um, the the music's just great. The whole ambiance of the game, you can just feel death. <laughs> Let's see what I do here. So here's me. Oh, I got it. I got it. Oh, oh. oh, down he went. No. Right to the midsection. Right to the midsection. Oh, he's getting me a lot. Dang it. I don't think there's a way to heal. Dang. They just keep having. Oh, off goes the head. Like Barbarian, he got my head. That's awesome. That was awesome. Dang it. So I got three lives left. I got some daggers. I got to figure out how to throw these daggers. And now it's the other knight's turn. Dang, I took out two. I'm not getting any points or anything. All right, this guy's backing off. That's good. Next day, I think I need to rest up. Can I just bypass and do nothing? Afraid I'm going to die again. Ah, what fun is doing nothing? Let's give it another shot. The gods pause for a moment. This is cool. I see a treasure chest. Oh, it's more of these birds. Dang, bird. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Dang it. I'm so weak. Ah, I lost another one. I can't even kill those birds. I think Spacebar said I get my stats. So I have one life left. Beware of the rat men during a full moon, for they grow stronger as the moon gets fuller. Huh. I didn't see where the phase of the moon it was in. 
Oh, I'm in grass. Grass fields now. Oh, what is this? Let's see if I can... Oh, I threw a dagger. <laughs> oh, he picked me up. Ah, oh, my goodness. I am dead. I see a tombstone cross up there. Dang, that was fast. Next day, game over. Ah, oh, can you believe that? That was awesome. I got to play this more. I'm not done yet. This is a... That was just round one, just trying it out and seeing what I could do. I played this game most of this weekend and slowly started getting better and winning some fights. It was pretty gory, but it was satisfying and I also made it to a town where I played some dragon dice and lost. I also visited Math the Wizard and if he's pleased with you, he'll give you magic items and money and raise your strength and constitution and endurance by one point. But if he's annoyed by your audacity, he'll turn you into a toad for several turns. And I learned this the hard way when I got too cocky and thought I could handle him. Lesson learned. I also visited Mithro the Mystic, renowned for lifting a knight's soul into a higher cosmic plane. And when your soul is returned to your body, you will find that your ability have been raised by our Lord by one point. Unfortunately, I must admit that I couldn't complete the game. It's tough, and I died so many times I lost count. But you know what? I had a blast playing this game. It's challenging, but it was also fun and rewarding. And even though I didn't make it to the end, I accomplished something by playing. That's it for today's episode of Virgin Amiga Chronicles. Thanks for joining me in my first playthrough of Moonstone, A Hard Day's Night. If you enjoyed watching, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Floppy Deep Dive for more classic retro gaming content. And be sure to check out my other series too, including What's on That Floppy, Many Faces, Dillard Dud, Atari vs. Commodore. And thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.